Hi friends, today I am giving a lecture on recursive algorithms for binary tree traversals such as pre-order, in-order and post-order. In the previous video, we are already discussed about binary tree traversal techniques such as uh, pre-order, in-order and post-order with some example problems. Now, in this video, we have to discuss about recursive algorithms for pre-order, in-order and post-order traversals. Okay, now this is the recursive algorithm for pre-order and this is the recursive algorithm for in-order and this is the recursive algorithm for post-order. Okay, now apply these three algorithms to this graph or tree. Okay, so what are the pre-order traversal technique result and what are the in-order traversal, traversal result and what are the post-order traversal result. Okay, first one, before going to the three recursive algorithms, first we have to create a structure. Okay. That structure name is node. Okay. So this structure contains three elements. One is the data element and second one is left pointer and third one is right pointer. So here we are creating a self-referential structure. Okay. So the structure name can be used as a member. Okay. So it points to the same structure. Okay, so these are the two self-referential structures, node pointer left, node pointer right. And this is the normal uh, member that is int data. Okay, so this data, this data member contains the data value and left pointer, left pointer points to the left subtree and right pointer points to the right subtree. Okay, this is the structure called node. Next, for that structure, we have to create a variable. That variable is temp. This is also a pointer variable. Okay, so this structure is for all the pre-order, in-order and post-order. Okay, this is the common for pre-order, in-order and post-order. Okay. Now go for a recursive algorithm for pre-order. So in the pre-order, first visit the root node that is D. Next, visit the left subtree in pre-order. Next, visit the right subtree in pre-order. Okay. Now consider this example. Okay. This is the root node. This can be denoted by D. Okay. Next. So this is all is, this is all is left subtree. Okay. And this is all is right subtree. Okay. So this is the root node. This all is the left subtree. And this all is the right subtree. Okay. Next, go to this one. Void pre-order. Void means this function does not return any value. Okay, so that because of that we have to use the data type void. Void pre-order node pointer temp. Here temp is a pointer variable that points to the root node. That points to the root node. Next, brace begin if temp not equal to null. Okay, here that means root node not equal to null. That means root node contains some value. Okay. If temp not equal to null means tree is empty. But here tree is not empty. So this condition is true. So go to the if block. In the if block there are three statements are there. Three statements are executed. First one printf percentage d temp tends to data. That means this is the temporary variable temp points to the root node okay temp tends to data means okay whatever the root node value that root node value is printed 
So that is root node value is 1 is printed. Next one, this is a recursive call pre-order temp dense to left. So this is a temp and this is left temp dense to left. Again we are getting this one. This is a, a root node and this is a left subtree and this is a right subtree. Okay. Now becomes this is a D and this is left and this is right. Okay. So in the same fashion we are executed in this way. Once we are uh, visiting all the vertices in the left subtree, so then go for this recursive call pre-order temp dense to right. Now go to this one. So this can be executed in the pre-order fashion. Okay. So what is the result we are getting? First D is visited. Next we are visiting all the vertices in the left subtree in pre-order fashion. In the pre-order fashion, 2, 4, 8, 9. Next, 5, 10, 11. 1, 2, 4, 8, 9, 5, 10, 11. So up to this one is left subtree is completed. This one is left subtree. One is the root node. Up to this point, this is the left subtree. Next one is right subtree. This right subtree is also executed in pre-order fashion. 3, 6, 12, 13. Next, 7, 14, 15. Okay. So this is right subtree. This is R and this is L and this is D. D, L, R. Okay. So this is the pre-order recursive pre recursive pre-order algorithm. First root node is printed. Root node is 1 is printed. Next one is left subtree. Total left subtree vertices are printed in DLR fashion. Okay. So first root node is printed. Left subtree contains these vertices. These vertices are visited in DLR fashion. After completed that one, then go for right subtree. D is completed, L is completed. This right subtree is also visited in DLR fashion. So this is a D, this is a L and this is R. In this way, we are visiting all the vertices in the tree. Okay. Next go for recursive algorithm for in order. Okay. So why in order node pointer? Okay. Here, Point, temp points to the uh, root node. Okay. Next. Brace begin. If temp not equal to null. So root node is not empty. As root node is not empty. So then break. This condition is true. This, mean, this means temp not equal to null means tree is not empty. That means root node is not empty. So this condition is true. Go to this one. In order temp dense to left. Okay. First left subtree is visited. So this is L, D, R. Okay. First left subtree is visited in in order fashion. Then visit the root node. So first visit first visit all the vertices in left subtree in in order fashion. Okay. In the in order fashion. So eight. 4, 9, 2, 10, 5, 11. So once we are visiting all the vertices in the left subtree in in order fashion. So 8, 4, 9, 2, 10, 5, 11. Okay. Next root node. Once we are completing all the vertices in left subtree. So this is all the vertices in left subtree. Next visit the root node. Next visit all the vertices in right subtree. So right subtree visit all the vertices in in order fashion. Okay. First visit the left subtree in recursive fashion. Once we are visiting all the vertices in left subtree. Then print the uh, root node value. After that 
visit all the vertices in right subtree in in order fashion in in order fashion first leftmost 12 6 13 3 14 7 15 12 6 13 3 14 7 15 okay so this is the right subtree and this is the root node and this is the left subtree okay so now this is the root node and this is left subtree and these are the nodes in the right subtree so d l r this is pre order next one these are the nodes in the left subtree that is l next this is the node root node and these are the nodes in right subtree okay right subtree okay next so this is a recursive call and this is a recursive call and this is the print the root node value okay next one now go for a recursive algorithm for post order so why post order node pointer temp so brace begin if temp not equal to null means root node is null no root node is not null it contains node 1 so that tree is not empty or root node is not empty so that this condition is true go to the inner of if block so here post order means l or d first visit the left subtree in post order fashion next visit the right subtree in post order fashion next visit the root node okay first visit the left subtree in post order fashion next visit the right subtree in post order fashion next visit the root node okay so now first visit the left subtree so this is the first left subtree is visited in post order fashion post order fashion means so left leftmost node is 8 8 next one right or 8 9 4 next one 10 11 5 next one 2 so 8 9 4 10 11 5 2 next one so up to now this is the this is the left subtree next one go to the right subtree so 12 13 6 14 15 7 3 up to 3 this is the right subtree so this is the right subtree and this is the root node so l r d l r d this is the post order up to this this is the left subtree all the elements in the left subtree are visited in the post order fashion next all the elements in the right subtree are visited in post order fashion last visit the root node okay so here in the post order root node is always at the last root node is always at the last in the post order fashion in the in order fashion root node is there in the middle in the in order root node is there in the middle in the pre order root node is there at beginning in the pre order root node is there in the beginning okay so this is the example and these are the recursive algorithms for in order pre order and post order this is the structure this uh, this is used for creating a, a node it contains three members one is a data member and the second two members are uh, pointers okay these pointers are called as self referential structure so these pointer variables points to the structure name okay so this is the structure variable so this is also a pointer variable this temp variable points to the root node this structure is for common for pre order in order and post order techniques so thank you thank you for watching this video if you like this video please share this video to your friends and classmates if you like this video please subscribe my channel name so develop srinivasa
Thank you.